All right, so in this video, I'm going to show you how to quickly and easily find fonts in Illustrator and then replace all versions of that particular font in the document. So maybe you have a font that's scattered throughout a really large document and it will take you a lot of time to find all the versions of that and change them out. This automatically does it all at once. So it's a very easy process. So to do that, you just want to go to type in the upper menu. And from type, you'll go down to find font, which is about halfway down the type menu. So you just want to click that. And from that, it'll bring up this find font menu, which will allow you to see what fonts are currently in the document. So this document has Archivo Black, Arvo Bold, and Archivo Narrow Bold. And if I click on these, it'll highlight versions of that particular font. So there's a bunch of instances of Archivo Black. And if you click find with multiple fonts, it'll just highlight different versions of that particular font throughout your document. So it's a really quick way to see where in your document that is. And there's only one Archivo Bold and only one Archivo Narrow. So those will just highlight those behind this window here. So let's say I wanna change out all the Archivo Blacks. I'll just select Archivo Black in this fonts and document area. And then you wanna go down to this section, which is below it and there's replace with font from, and you can choose recent, which are recent fonts you've had opened up. You can choose document, which will allow it to replace it with other fonts in the document. So I'd say, if you know what you wanna change the font out to ahead of time, just stick that font somewhere in the document so you can find it easily. Or you can also go to your entire system fonts. So basically any font that's currently active on your computer, you can go ahead and just switch them out like that. So I'm gonna select a random font here called band shrift bold and then what you can do is you can either change which will change just the font that's highlighted or change all which will change all the fonts that are currently selected in this upper section so i currently have archive of black selected which is the many of these hey nows that are all over the place i'm going to hit change all because i want to change all of them you can see it does that in real time and then you can just click done because you're done alternatively if you want to go to the next font, which is Archivo Narrow, or perhaps the Arvo Bold, which is right here, same process. You can find a different font to change it to. So I'll change it to this black oak font. And then there's just one of it. So I can either click change or change all. doesn't matter. In this case, that's a really wide font. So it kind of overlaps things here. But you can see how easy it is to quickly go through and then change fonts. And that all replaces it up here in your fonts and document. So if you want to change that font at a later time, it's all still here, really fast and easy to do. So when you're done, just click done, then you're good to go. And also it's just really helpful to know what fonts are currently in your document so you don't have any straggler fonts that are not intended to be there. So if you go to type and then from type, go to find font once again, you can just know I have exactly three fonts in my document currently. Should those be the fonts in my document? If not, you can find out where they are and then remove or change them as you need to. So that's it for this video. Really fast video, but I think this is a really cool thing to know that saves you a lot of time. So I thought it was worth sharing. So if you found this helpful, please do me a favor and hit the thumbs up button to let me know. If you have any questions or comments, feel free to leave those in the comment section. And if you want to see more stuff like this, please subscribe. I do my best to keep creating videos just like this for designers. Thank you so much for watching.